Hello guys, in this video we will see how to download and install Java JDK on Windows 11 operating system. The process is same for all Windows operating systems. Once installed, then we will see how to configure environment variables for Java Home. Then we will see how to execute the sample Java program on Windows machines. Okay, so go to Google, then search for Java JDK. Hit enter, click on the first link that is Java Downloads for Oracle. I will keep this link in the video description. See here, we have the latest stable version that is Java 21. Okay, so select the JDK 21, then select the operating system type whether it is Linux, Mac OS or Windows. So we are going to install it on Windows. Okay, click on Windows. Click on this x64 installer. Its size is 163.82 megabytes. Click on this exe file or bin file. Both are fine. Okay. Go to down see download has been started. Go to downloads. See here. Its size is 164 megabytes. Wait until this download completes. Before installing Java, let's verify whether Java is installed or not on your machine by opening command prompt. Then just give Java hyphen hyphen version. See, Java is not recognized as an internal or external command, operable program or batch file. Okay. Now, once download is completed, click on the exe file. Wait, click on next. See, this is the installation directory. Okay, if you want to change this one, you have to click on this change button, then we have to provide the path. Otherwise, click on next. See, we have successfully installed Java. Now open command prompt again, run the same command Java hyphen hyphen version. See, still it is not showing. Close this one and again open the command prompt. CMD Java hyphen hyphen version. See, we have installed Java 21. Okay, now we will see how to create Java Home and configure. Okay, go to folders, C drive, program files, here Java C. JDK 21. Copy this path. Now open environment variables by searching in here. See here. Edit the system environment variables. Otherwise, right click on the PC name. Then properties. Then advanced system settings. See, we got the same system properties. Click on environment variables. Now in system variables, Go to the path, then click on edit. Now click on new, then paste that path. Copy this path and go to the again click on new, then paste that path. Okay, click on OK, click on OK, click on OK. Now let's create a sample Java file in C drive. or go to C then C practice create a new Java file the name hello world dot Java no, no, we have to create the file not the directory right click and new then select the text file here give the name as hello world dot java Hit enter click on s 
see now it is java source file okay now go to cd cd see we have the java file okay now now put some code in this java file open file with are any fine notepad copy this sample example then paste here then save the file close it now again go to c practices open this file verify the text see here we have that program okay now go to command shell cls to clear screen dir file is there now execute this java file java c then hello world hit enter c it is execution is success check again c it has created r to schools class because it contains r to class r to schools okay now see the output just give java then r to schools hit enter see it has printed the output it is there in this one see first line prints hello world second line prints second line but but if you modify this file just by adding another line give third line save the file again run java r2 schools see we got the same output every time if we modify java file we must have to execute or compile the java file okay so java c r2 hello world dot java Hit enter now again run java r2 school see now the updated line has been printed okay this is the way okay so in this video we have seen how to download install and configure the configure the environment variables in windows operating system then we have seen how to create java file and executor compile the java programs for more videos please subscribe my channel thank you